Hey everyone, okay, today I am over here, just woke up in the morning, I really wasn't planning on doing a video, but, um, but I decided to. So I have little Benjamin here with me as my guest. <laughs> um, well, let's see what's going on. I did the chickens this morning, took care of them. And um, I woke up and I'm starting something today that I wanted to share with you. But uh, I just wanted to let you know what was going on with us. Today I am diffusing uh, clary sage. Now, I'm going to be honest because I love doTERRA. I do my, um, let me see, loyalty rewards order every month. And I love it because... Um, that way you you know you're wholesale so you're buying a little bit cheaper and at the same time they give you points so uh, eventually you get a free product and I've already received the free product actually uh, I don't see it right here I thought all my essential oil oh I know some of them are in my purse but um yeah I received a free essential oil last month and I also get points and then that'll eventually give me some cash back as well as another free product. Um, just monthly depending on what they're giving, they just give you that. But what I was saying is today I am diffusing some clary sage and it is not uh, um, from doTERRA because I haven't yet transitioned my clary sage over so um, I'm just using what I have plus I did, I am diffusing my lavender because it's that time of the month, don't we just love it? <laughs> so I'm using Clary Calm. I don't know if you can see that if that's in focus. But anyway, this is Clary Calm. And what I like to do is I rub it on my belly. And um, I kind of, I actually haven't done it today yet, but I will. And I also like to just do this. <laughs> it, it smells like perfume. It's not actually my favorite scent, to be honest. But I use it for the benefits of um, trying to calm me during this time of the month. So that's what's going on with my diffusing. So if you smell something wonderful, <laughs> that's what it is. <laughs> um, okay, now I, I, another thing I wanted to let you know was a few weeks ago I was in the middle of, um, with my children, we went and collected some wild white clover. And I just wanted to show you that I'm diffusing it. I mean, not diffusing it. I am um, making a tincture of it right here. So it's in the jar. I, I, I put this video up just, uh, I think, a week or two ago. So it'll be ready this week um, at the end of the week. So just shaking it every day. Shh. And um, that's what's going on with that. Now another thing is, I haven't yet put up this video because I have to edit it, but I do make my own homemade um, shampoo. However, uh, I forgot to buy the coconut milk that I make it with, and I really didn't want to do the honey lemon one that I have, um, another that I'm going to do a video of. I just was kind of like, whatever, I'm just going to buy. And when I do buy, which is rare, I like to buy this, um, this, uh, this pro this brand which I'm not affiliated with but I just really like them so I wanted to share with you they're called Alba Botanica and um, this is a Hawaiian shampoo the focus is really not good it's really not focusing very well on the um products but I did want to share that with you this is the coconut milk one which I love so I buy the shampoo and conditioner and that's what I uh, did this morning I shampooed and conditioned my hair and I just brushed it and now you have this so it'll like you know get over the next few hours it'll get poofier I don't know it'll get volume to it you know but that's what I like to use and I really don't put other products in my hair um, sometimes I might throw some uh, argan oil or some coconut oil maybe shea butter I try to stick with all natural stuff and that's another thing about this I love it is like um this is one of the I mean don't get me wrong there are a few things in it that are not exactly uh um you know all, all natural they did have another one that I saw for the first time and maybe if I get it I'll let you guys know about it but it was like half the size for the same price this one was eleven dollars ten seventy nine eleven dollars um and so was this one so half of that you know half of this for the same price I was just like ah oh, maybe we'll wait till next time <laughs> all right so the main reason for my video so what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be going raw vegan for a time I don't um 
I believe in uh, being, or I wouldn't, I don't know if I would say raw vegan is the right way to say it. Maybe just uh, a raw food diet. Let's say it like that. We're going to be doing the raw food diet. Um, it's not going to be 100%. It's going to be like 90% for about, we're going to try three months, but our goal is 90 days. Oh yeah, no, three, we're going to try 30 days, but our goal is 90 days, it's three months. So, um, the children are not going to be 100% on it, because like I said, it's going to be 90% raw food, but there will be for the children, um, some cheese and, um, a few other things I wrote down, I can't remember right, right now. But, the reason we're doing this is because, you know, um, right now, the past, like, maybe two or three weeks, I, every time I get tired at night, I've been feeling a little nauseous. And at first I thought I was pregnant, so I was like, oh, excited, but I'm not pregnant. <laughs> so I'm just like, okay, I need to address this. And the best way I know how to address it, and, um, you know, for healing is I'm going to start incorporating a lot more raw foods into our diet. Like I said, about 90%. And then even the 10% that's not raw, um, I'm not sure what, what it's going to be like. Uh, but it's not going to be, the, maybe it's just going to be like soaked nuts. Um, uh, let me think, uh, some cottage cheese, um, flaxseed oil, you know, it's not going to be anything crazy, like, um, we're definitely going to be cutting out rice and eggs for now, milk, like our raw milk, um, just for the time of healing, and also another thing is, David has been having some joint, like, issues, like, with his knees, so, um, he went to play basketball, Sorry guys, he went to play basketball about two weeks ago and it's like around the same time that I started feeling not that good. And then his joints Sorry. were hurting him. So, actually his joints, his knees were hurting him. And so I've been giving him uh, basically the, um, the deep blue blend. I mix it up with some castor oil. Wait, castor oil? Yes, castor oil. And he rubs it on his knee. And um, I also he finished the little packs. I have to place it with my new loyalty or uh, loyalty rewards order, which will be coming in uh, next week. So um, I've also been giving him vitamins, uh, certain supplements that are good for joints. Um, and oh, and you know what? I I actually I'm gonna do a separate video on nettle tea because nettle tea is just awesome. Hold on one second. Boys, I need you in the room with the door closed. Thank you. What? Now, see mommy is your answer. I don't, nobody's, oh, okay, this is gonna take way too long. So I'm just gonna end my video here. As we go along uh, with our raw food diet, we will be, you know, letting you guys follow along with us on our journey. And I just wanted to let you know about that. Um, make sure to subscribe so that you can follow us along and see what's going on with us. And um, I'm, I'm going to try to do a video today. Well, see the thing is we're going to finish the food we have right now. So we're going to finish the food we have. And um, I'm personally going to start ASAP as much as I can with more raw foods right now with what we have in our, in our refrigerator. But for the next uh, few weeks we will be buying raw mainly raw foods and i'll do a new grocery haul with that and um take you guys along with us so uh yeah make sure to click uh you know that um the links below and also tap that bell tap that bell guys all right so you can be informed every time we upload a video all right thanks for watching and god bless